hello students welcome back to my channel in this video i am going to discuss in detail about the suspension polymerization so in order to overcome the drawbacks of the emulsion polymerization suspension polymerization is developed so suspension polymerization can be considered as advanced technique over the emulsion polymerization at the same time heat control is possible by using suspension polymerization especially in the case of addition polymerization so in this suspension polymerization we will consider three elements for the preparation of polymers such as polyvinyl chloride polyvinyl acetate polystyrene etc so initially the monomer is suspended in the form of relatively large droplets of the size 1 mm in large amount of water then emulsifying agents such as gelatin at the same time cellulose derivatives are added so the importance of cellulose derivatives is it helps to form the stable emulsion and then the initiators that means what is the purpose of initiators initiators will act as the catalyst so catalyst such as hydrogen peroxide or benzoyl peroxide will be added then what happens whenever catalyst like benzoyl peroxide is added then it dissociates to give hydroxy free radicals so they act as initiators and then polymerization takes place so coming to the suspension polymerization initially what happens the monomer is taken in the form of large droplets in water so let us suppose that here the monomers are dispersed in large quantity of water and then what happens emulsifying agents will be added next initiators will be added these are the initiator molecules and here remember that monomers being large droplets there is a probability of joining together so that means aggregation of the monomers may takes place so in order to avoid the aggregation of the monomers always the solution is agitated by using mechanical stirrer so it is the mechanical stirrer which is used to disperse the large monomer droplets in large amount of the water then what happens here the initiators are also available with the result they generate free radicals and hence at each monomer droplet the polymerization takes place so whenever the initiator is added then what happens the polymerization takes place at each droplet and finally it results in the formation of the polymers having the shape pearl or bead shape and hence at once this suspension polymerization can also be called as bead or pearl polymerization so what is the other name for suspension polymerization it can be called as bead or pearl polymerization why here the polymer is obtained 
in the form of a pearl or bead and hence it can be called as bead or pearl polymerization this is about the suspension polymerization let us discuss about the applications and advantages of the suspension polymerization so coming to the applications of suspension polymerization this method is highly useful for the preparation of polyvinyl acetate polyvinyl chloride polystyrene even it is highly useful for the preparation of pmma that means polymethyl meth acrylate in other words it is called as flexi glass so this technique is highly useful for the preparation of flexi glasses so coming to the advantages of this suspension polymerization is heat control is possible through this suspension polymerization so the polymer is obtained with high levels of purity so the polymer obtained is having high levels of purity at the same time this technique is economical these are the advantages of the suspension polymerization coming to the disadvantages of this suspension polymerization here the polymerization takes place at each monomer droplet and hence sometimes two droplets may join together and hence it is highly impossible to control the bead size at the same time this technique is applicable for the monomers which are insoluble in water so what are the disadvantages sometimes it may not be possible to control the bead size and this technique is highly useful for the monomers which are insoluble in water this is all about the suspension polymerization if you like the video don't forget to like share and subscribe thanks for watching have a nice day